AAE up in this bit. Now it's lit. Here we go. Hey, You said the key word. You said if when we do bring people here, if I pay to get on, no, 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 no. How come we can't have somebody bring somebody big here, get some artists from the city that deserve it, and pay them? Why they can't be paid too? They artists. Why we can't treat us like artists? And right. if there's money in it, because you're going to make that money back. Right. Everything I ever did in the city, I had to pay for. Let's say, okay, let's say I'm like, I had to pay I'm a big T.I. fan. Let's say I like, I want to get T.I. here. So I know it's going to cost some money to get him here because it's T.I. Yeah. But I'm going to get him here because I got the money. I got the financial backing. So now I need other acts. It can't just be T.I. This nigga Whiteside is a prominent yeah. artist in the city. Yeah. I'm gonna put White Side on there. Yeah. With T.I. Yeah. I'm not gonna charge White Side. Yeah. I'm actually pay White Side because yeah. he's a prominent artist. He deserves it. Yeah. So now we have a, a show to where he's not like roaching trying to get there. Yeah. Let me let me perform. Let me. No no no. Yeah. He's he's VIP. He, he's good. he earned this spot here. So now the uh, like T.I. when they come, he might be curious. Like who's this yeah. nigga that exactly. is being treated like I'm getting treated? Yeah exactly. You know what I'm saying? Then he go up there, he get his time. It ain't like you get, you get three minutes. All right, you get three minutes to go do your thing. No, he gets a full set. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, how come we can't do it? There's so many people here that make money. There's so many people here that make money that fuck with different camps. And when they bring people here, it's them only. Right. I'm going to get on stage. I'm bringing them here, so I'm going to get on. Yeah. Let's put our best on. Right. You might not be our best. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like... Right. Fuck it, you know what I'm saying? Even if you, okay, everybody want to make it. So, okay, let's say you do want to get on. Fuck it, it's your show, get on. But how come we can't put other people on that, that we know, you know what I'm saying? Like he was just saying, uh, Kenny G, right? You said he been grinding, been busting his ass. Yeah, yeah. Then uh, maybe he's somebody that deserved to get on stage too. Yeah. And get paid for it. Yeah. But he Shit, he put the time. Wouldn't nobody give him one, so he took them. That's what I'm saying. So it's like... And How come we can't? There's so many people here that make money. It's, it's a lot of niggas that make money here in all kinds of different ways. You know what I'm saying? May not be on the up and up, but they getting paid. They fuck with people's camps. They'll back people. But shit, how come we can't partner with these people? You know you're going to get the money back because you got a big artist coming. You can charge them tickets. You can charge VIP. You're going to make your money back. We know that. So it's like. But at the time, they want to be the. Like, that's uh, what I'm saying. Did this, did, that's, what, that's what I'm saying. Like, man, we'll put you on the fly. It's yours. Yeah. But yeah, how come we can't? You know what I'm like, saying? God, it's yours, fam. But how come we can't partner with somebody that that a sponsor that like people that got money like that that's willing to do it? Yeah. It's just it's little stuff like that. I wonder because I be seeing like people bring artists here. You know what I'm saying? All the time. But it's like they'll bring artists here and it'll be their thing. Yeah, exactly. You like hit them up like, yo, what's up with the show? I'll I, I, I hit you back. To do that to open up for them type artists. And it's like, damn, I couldn't even bring me and my team back in the back with the camera to catch footage with us. I can't I can't chop it up with the artists. The Nick, I might, you never know. I can't do nothing. I could have chopped it up with them before I went on stage. Oh, yeah, I'm, ooh, ooh, I'm opening up for you. What's up? Ooh, ooh, and did my thing. And then I, he already spoke to me. And now he extra like me from what he might have heard my crap and shit. We don't get none of that. We just come out the crowd. Yeah. We call a nigga out the crowd. <laughs> nigga that pain all that just kind of. Hey, where you at? Yeah. Come on up here. Nigga don't no, even no, know no, your no, name. No, no, no. Damn, you the. <laughs> Fuck. Nigga don't even know your name. He reading your shit. Come on, man. I pay. Artists get up there with about fifty-seven niggas. Yeah. Shit, you got to. Sometimes. It's like, Cause, okay. Cause you got to sometimes. Cause ninety percent of the time you perform at the venue, they don't got the sound system, the sound music. They don't got your. They don't got the music, the shit good enough or up to date for you to hear. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna please the crowd off dancing. So I gotta, ha they gotta be able to hear me and yeah. make me understand what I'm saying. 
So when the sound system and shit, they got all fucked up. It's good to have 40 niggas up there. Y'all gonna be looking dumb. I'm saying some of them times they be. So listen. They know what song playing and they back there. Yeah. We all up here. Nah, yeah. Nah, I'm, nah, nah, I'm just going. I'm saying how they'll tell, uh, they tell the local artists, you can't come on stage. With and, it be just and then the main artists come up there with can do whatever they want. It's like, you can't tell me shit. How Bitch, my I'm performing go. too. I'm going to do what the fuck I want to do. And if not, the main act not going to get to perform because we finna perform in another way. We finna <laughs> fuck your venue up. God damn you it. You know what I'm saying? Nah, I'm not an asker. I'm a taker. I'm going yeah. to take my yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not going to... None of that shit. I ain't paying none of that. I'm not finna pay in my own town. Like, and guess what? Thank if you, you don't put me on that big show, oh, you're going to wish you did later oh. anyway. But I'm not going to come back with that. Yeah, I bet you... No, I'm yeah. not going to do that. My success. They, you're going to rub my success in your own face. Say, you know what I mean? So it's like was, the more doors that get closed on me, I be thankful. I be like, yes, thank you. Because that means that's way less motherfuckers that's going to be coming with their hands out. Because you know you fucked over me when I was at the bottom. So why would I fuck with you when I'm on top? You yeah. see what I'm saying? It's not it's, fuck you. I'm never saying, I don't care if a motherfucker come to my face and be like, fuck you. I don't, I'm not finna give you the energy to say fuck you back. I'm gonna be like, thank you for telling me how you feel about me. And I'm gonna keep it moving. You the one that feel like fuck me. So since it's really fuck me and I'm ignoring you, I'm gonna fuck your whole little world up. Cause you're like, damn it, I'm not affecting them. So like when, when these promoters be doing that, that shit is on purpose. Like, yeah. we're gonna exclude this nigga. Yeah. yeah. But when you do that, you showing your hand. Yeah. You showing what kind of person you are. Say. It's just sometimes the city don't see that because they so turned up on the big artists being in their yeah, city right. and they finna go turn up. They not paying attention that this promoter that just brought them down here is fucking over their own artists. They own if artists. they gave a fuck, yeah. they'll be like, nah, we not with that. But yeah. they actually participating in fucking over their own artists. So when the Austin people be like, why well, ain't nobody and from the city made it yet? Because you motherfuckers ain't supported. Yeah, so they, they can re-up off of get their money back off. I said real. That's what they can get their money back. Yeah. They spend so they like what shit. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna See, charge I, why I, I he go because he gonna tell everybody money he yet. need to come to that exactly. Like bro, exactly. I just I done paid exactly. you the front end. I done paid you the front end. Or how I don't even know how to find it back this shit. But let's say it go like this. You charging 10 bands. I done paid you the front end. I done paid you five for you to get here. Yeah. But I ain't got that other five yet. So I'm finna charge Ether, Whiteside, and every other yeah, to get 500 it. to perform. Yeah. So I can so I guarantee can that, I, that, that, I, that, that I get it back. And then yeah. once everybody get there, I'ma get your money at the door. That's why I say when they made Modesto, when they made Janky Promoter, they yeah. came to Austin and looked how shit worked, and this yeah. is Modesto. Yeah. And then they made the movie. Yeah. Cause it ain't nothing but Janky Promoters floating around yeah. this bitch. Like, you know, since, okay, since, since I'm doing the little all this interview shit i got a question so here in austin there are a lot of people that do music that have connections here right True. and ain't like okay let's let's say like Shout south by up. south by come it's a lot of people that got connections to these venues to these places that are official and that they have those connections to where they can put people on that could boost us because South by is one of the world that got their eyes on us. How many people would you say have told you, like, as far as, like, artists in the city or people that are musically connected, connected musically somehow here? How many people say that they fuck with you? Oh, shit. I, I'm, I say at least 98.3% of them. So they, they fuck, fuck with, with you. Yeah. When South by came, how many people hit you like, yo, I got a connection to an official show? And are you trying to be a part of it, or I want to put you on it? How many people hit you and did that? Why, sir? How many you say? None. So, yeah. How crazy is that? Um, How crazy is that, extremely, man? Extremely, but expected on my behalf. But Austin, okay. Because, like I said, hold on, let me. I'm gonna say I'm saying this because people get they they feel like a certain way. I'm saying this. I always say Austin, we don't fuck with each other. Right, we don't fuck with each other. That's me saying it. I say Austin don't fuck with each other. People be like, nah, man. All you gotta do is, you know, what I'm saying, get with the movement. Where is it? Does that mean I gotta get with your team? I can't keep doing what I'm doing. And and True. and earn my own merit and still garner your respect. Like, what do I have to do? You know, what I'm saying to do that. So then, when I feel away, when I say, all right, I'm finna start naming niggas. I'm finna just start coming at because fuck it. That's what I'm doing now. 
You know what I'm saying? I did that little freestyle. I put names in it. I don't give a fuck. Yeah. Because I don't feel like nobody's better than me. Facts. And since, since niggas don't want to give me that credit, now I got to take it. Now, with everything that we just discussed, because I be watching. I've seen the people that come. That's why I was asking. I've seen the people that come like, why side got this going? Why side got that going? Man, his, hey, y'all heard that album? You know what I'm saying? Like that bit, y'all heard Skinny Hendrix? That shit is crazy. That's why I want to know, because I don't know when you're on your own personal time, how many people hit you up and be like, yo, I got this show. I want to put you on. Yo, I got this and that going on. I know you do shows. But like how many times when it's something that really benefits you, has somebody ever really reached out? Because there's people that's, that's making a little money around here. How many of those people have ever hit you that say they fuck with you to actually put you in a position to where you can better yourself or make some money or something like that? Has that ever happened for you? Nope. Not at all. And that's crazy. I'm going to give him his credit. Clover put me on the show of Flamingo Cantina. You know what I mean, Clover the Rap Gang, yo, shout out to the homie for that. He put me on the show like that. That was a lot of years ago. You know what I mean? And around that time, you know what I mean, 13, 2013, 2014 era, it was a nice amount of love shown, but shit, I'm fresh out of prison. So, like, a lot of people get shown love then. And then y'all was putting it down for me with the free white side movement. So, it was kind of like the season to fuck with me. You know what I mean? It yeah. Was kinda like, that season was in, but once that season ended, I was still on my ground with the music and, and shit. It slowed down drastically. And then we here, 2018, and I can go back to as far as 2015. Almost everybody that be online supporting me or saying I'm considered this top tier material or I'm great or whatnot, they don't fuck with me in real life. They don't, they'll throw a show right after seeing one of them comments and won't put me on. And then, like I said in the interview with the B102.3, they'll say that they, they rock with me and then put a post out about who should I put on the show. And then the, the people that they asking that to is saying, white side, white side, white side, white side. Not only me, they say a lot of other people, but I'm saying yeah. in the same post, my name would get mentioned. And they don't put me in there. And, you know, I, Do could you? Be, I could be a rapper and respond like a rapper and, and and make posts and make songs about it and all of it, but I just don't care because I ain't no local ass nigga. Like, I'm global, bitch. The fuck you think? You think you trying to close doors on me locally gonna work when I'm thinking global? You know what I mean? But as a human, hell yeah, I feel it. That shit feel fucked up when the same people you're doing it for ain't doing shit for you. That's what I was gonna ask next. Like, when, when these conversations come up, I know it's gratifying when people mention you. And I've seen you mention, you know, when people be like, oh, who the hottest artist in the city? Seen you mention quite a bit, and I always mention you. And that's just, that's not even on some team shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's just on some honest shit. But it's like, when people mention you and shit like that, when they have certain discussions, um, let's say about shows, we were talking about that earlier. When people talk about shows, do you feel a way when you're not mentioned as far as like how you perform? Do you feel like you have one of the top performances, like as as far as people in the city? I know. You know, feel. I know. They know. And I feel fucked up. Um, emotionally drained by it. Uh, stressed out. Frustrated. Uh, be wanting to give up. All that that kind of shit. But it's only because I do this shit passionately. This is me. This ain't no habit. This ain't no motherfucking hobby. This me. I am music. It's everything about me is music. So for me to have been in this city my whole life, about music my whole life, and you saying you want somebody about music and all that on your sets, and you gotta be serious people, and it's for the city and all that, how can you ignore a person that's been doing it for the city for so long? So hell yeah, that shit hurt as a human. I'm a motherfucking god, so I don't let human shit stop me. I keep pushing, because I know that not everybody is going to dislike me. Right. I know that. Yeah. So it's like, with my little mathematical equation I use, if you put me, if you give me access to all 50 states in America, and all those cities, and all them little country towns, I take the low end. Three out of 10 is a low number to some people, but when you look at 30% out of 100, if you give me 30%, 
out of 100 out of all the people in every city, state, and town in just America. Look at how the numbers is. Oh, that's good numbers. You see what I'm saying? So Big now numbers. I'm on by just taking my little bit, by taking my crumbs and not complaining. Big my numbers. crumbs then became a big ass meal. But I know them crumbs ain't gonna mean shit in Austin where people got reasons to hate me. I fucked your bitch in high school. Um, I beat your homeboy up, or I might have beat you up, or you might have beat me up but still holding a grudge because you beating me up didn't stop me. Sometimes people get mad that you don't stop. You know what I mean? They know you're human. They know, you know what I mean? In their mind, because I ain't no fucking human, I'm going to say that all the time. But in their mind, they see you human and they see how to get at you. So they pick at you, pick at you, and when it don't work, it's like, damn, because that's nigga shit. Niggas love to pull each other down, but when a nigga trying to pull you down and biting at you and it's not working, it, it get fucked up. So like I said, they got reasons to not support me. Like, I'm in this town with you. I got a reason to not like you. You had the J's before me, or, you know what I mean? One of your homeboys fuck my bitch. It's always reasons for people in your city to hate you, but when you go elsewhere in the world, they don't have those reasons. So the only thing they have is what you present to them, the music. So they gonna give it a, a, a chance based on the music. Do I like it or not? That's why I say motherfuckers gotta get out their cities. I feel the same shit we got going on in Austin with the local hatred. That shit happening everywhere else in the world because ain't nobody around you gonna support you. A nigga ain't gonna wanna see another person make it above them. And I say nigga because it's a different between yeah, black yeah, folks yeah. and niggas. Like you got honorable black folk that help their people, and you got niggas of every race that are trying. I about to say niggas down. universal. That shit is all of them. The word nigger is ignorant. Motherfuckers is ignorant in every race. You don't have to be. You don't have to be of melanated descent to be a nigger. All that nigga ass shit. We don't, we don't do all that shit. You ain't come from my fabric. You are not cut from this t-shirt. You better go do your research. Used to sell dope to my feet hurt. Now I just put it in each verse. She said she like when I eat first. Just like to make women ski first. Perform like a star until she burst. Don't have a towel, she wipe off with my t-shirt. Talk like a handsome and totally ratchet. Still get on the beats and go totally tragic. No, I'm a sad, but they lied in my bracket. They know that they are nowhere near my status. That is why static, they do not want any. How you get served by a nerd or some skinnies? Anyways, back to the fact I'm a go though. Do fuck your girl, but I did get that throw though. Game in the chokehold. And I when I let go, not even when I feel they finally respect me. They like you don't gotta do it so messy. Yeah, like my daddy didn't have to neglect me. Still didn't stop me from growing up traumas. I find my own way to deal with the pain. Pull me from drinking and sip on my sorrow. Tell her today I'm not promised tomorrow. I'm a motherfucking savage. I'm a motherfucking savage. I'm a motherfucking savage. I'm a motherfucking savage. If she bad, then I had it. Yeah, like 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 she b